and welcome to the Kennedy Space Center. Before we go into our amazing recipe today, I want to give a shout out to Hero's personal channel, Hero Tarada Day Off, as well as my personal channel, Charles Preston. Funny thing is we've both been on YouTube since 2007, 10 years ago, think about that, almost 11. So check out what I'm doing. There'll be giveaways as well as Hero's channel, his personal channel. He's got a bunch of giveaways as well. <coughs> I haven't really worked on my own personal channel, but what you'll see is mostly automotive things. Pretty much what I'm into. Hero's as well. He's into automotive. He's into vlogging his food and even does recipes there. So make sure you give it a follow and give myself a follow. I appreciate it all. Now if you want to see what I'm doing here, you're going to have to check my channel out. And this is really cool. See y'all soon. Enjoy the episode. And welcome to another edition of Hiroyuki Terada, Diaries of a Master Sushi Chef. Rosan, how are you? Very good. Excellent. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. Yes. We have some very special yeah, friends and guests of ours. special guests today. Yes. You want to introduce them, Hiro? My favorite you know, bubble tea place. Favorite bubble tea? Yeah, Monkey Bubble Tea. Monkey's oh. Bubble Tea in Miami Beach. You yes. may have seen one of the videos before. This is a proprietor. This is Jose. Hey, how are you? And this is Eliana. Hola. Hola. Buenas tardes. Yes. Como siempre. <laughs> okay, Jose, tell us about your business. Tell us about your bubble tea before we go into this amazing video. The bubble tea is really, really good. It's amazing. We have some flavors here to show you something. This is the uh, iced tea. Maybe it's that you prefer blue, blueberry with black tea. Always I prefer to put tapioca pearls. It's really fresh and everything. And this is with milk, no dairy creamer. The traditional one is my favorite. This is the taro, honeydew, and this is the coconut. We have a lot of flavors there, so you can come wherever you want. You need to really come good. for sure. And my favorite, of course, I always say, I always like this black tea with a blackberry. And I newly discovered this taro and coconut combination half and half is now my official favorite one too. Yeah, so you guys really got to definitely try it. And we really appreciate them coming by because we're doing a very interesting video today. Mm. It is called Super Warm Sushi. Oof. <laughs> really good. And we needed to find some people that wouldn't mind tasting, right? So you got to watch to the very end for the tasting part. But mm. of course, the start of the show is our Super Worms. And these you can find at your local pet store. These are fed to frogs. They are fed to bearded dragons, to scorpions, all types. And... Actually, they're very clean. They're clean eating because they're bred just for uh, for feeding pets, and you won't find any uh, anything dirty from them. You know, they're bred in store. So, okay, Hero San. Sure. Are you ready for this epic? Yeah, it's very, very exciting. <laughs> Are you going to be trying I, I it here? I couldn't sleep last night. <laughs> <laughs> and also, we have another very incredible video for you, but we'll leave it as a surprise that has to do with one of these worms with another type of animal that we were able to buy. Okay, here, let's All set right, up and we'll sure. begin. Today is a food from Pet Tomato. <laughs> Not from the market. All right, thank you so much. All right. Okay, here, son. Okay, so today is a bit most exciting. <laughs> the dish we are going to make it. So, and also uh, today we're going to make a sushi. We haven't done long uh, for a while, you know. So let's go to introduce ingredients. For first one, super warm. Super warm. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and you are not going to be trying this later, huh? Oh. These are all live, yeah, very yeah. clean. I think one day when there's no more fish in the ocean mm. and people want to go vegetarian, maybe, I don't know what this would be considered, but it's very clean eating and a very good source of protein. Mm. You know, there are some restaurants out there in the U.S. that are specializing in insects used in sushi. So maybe this is going to create awareness for everyone mm -hmm. who's tired of eating fish yeah. and they don't want, they want to conserve the, the oceans and what the ocean brings and of course they're vegetarian or they don't want to eat any animals this is your go-to protein now protein, right? okay first i'm gonna do uh cook this warm with okay. uh, uh i'm gonna use the garlic and ginger and uh, the butter and then uh, soy sauce and a little bit of sesame oil and salt and pepper okay then after that i'm gonna mix with the blue cheese with the uh, cooked warm inside of the roll and then on the, the, the top, I'm gonna put the wasabi mayo and the scallion and a little bit of wasabi and then maybe a little bit more extra warm. Oh, How about keeping some live? Hmm? 
Will that be okay? Oh, maybe we'll ride warm on the top of the yes. sushi? Yes, yeah, yeah. Oh. Or halfway in and half out, what do you think? <laughs> you, you, you are the fast one to test, test that. <laughs> I'm the cameraman. Mm. Okay, Hero, let's begin. Okay. Let's go to cook this one. Okay. Right. I've never seen this done. I've seen it in some of the YouTube videos, but... Yeah, I never done it too. Yeah, <laughs> you never done it too. I never done it too. Okay. We can start with the medium heat. Okay, medium heat. Yeah. Olive oil. oil. And then I start throwing the warm inside out. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that's a beef on the slice is ready. <coughs> I will tell you something, that garlic with that oil, yeah, it's, uh, it smells good. Oil and the, uh, <sighs> the warm self is going to be... It smells like bacon. Yeah. You can smell that, right? Oh, if you're at home, it's not as bad as it seems, people. I'm telling you. Not as bad as it seems. Any moving still here? No. So, yeah, some of it still looks like a I told it I Okay. Oof. Oh, we dropped you one. See that? Now, I'm gonna put that a little bit butter on it. Oh. <laughs> and butter makes it all delicious. Smooths out the flavor. And then, I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, Salt and pepper. And soy sauce. And the uh, olive oil, uh, sorry, uh, sesame oil a little bit. It smells great, I'm telling you. That's good, right? Smells like a chicken teriyaki. <laughs> <laughs> Just close your eyes and enjoy. Okay. That's it. Okay. Nice. Looks good. Beautiful. Um, I thought saw some moving, but I guess not. Yeah, some are still moving. <laughs> still moving? Yeah, some are still moving. <laughs> okay, yo. Okay. Smells great, though, I can tell you. This thing is here. Alindo, no? It's delicious. If you, yeah. yeah. Let's see. Mm. What does it taste like to you? No, it's delicious. I like it. Good, Very right? Good. Very good. Mm. Excellent. Oh. <laughs> okay, hello, son. All right. Are you so, ready? next step is going to be rolling up warm sushi. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yes, Let's also. Nico, y uno más. ¿Cuál uno más? No, my gordita. No, un tostadito. Como chicharrón. Una cabecita rico. Super rico. Buenísimo. There you have it. Hero can make anything delicious. Hero, two out of two. They're loving it. How about you? You have to try one, Hero. Hero, smells good, looks good, it must taste good. First one, I'm gonna put the uh, wasabi oil. This is so simple. This is one of my favorite things in sushi if you can try it at home. Okay, this one, I'm gonna keep in this one here. Okay. Okay, next step, let's go to make a sushi. Roll. Mm. Uh, seaweed 
things here. So it's a three-quarter sheet, yeah. not really half, not really full. A little bit to be good. Okay. Yeah, it seems like a long time since you've done sushi. Yeah, I haven't done a uh, long time so sushi. <laughs> so I almost last uh, two months. I then I haven't made the sushi. So this is a great Willet sushi here. Oh, Willet sushi, super warm. Super warm. I guess anything can sushi. Yeah. So today I'm gonna instead of the sesame seeds, okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of dry onion on the outside. All right. Nice. And this comes done already. You can buy it in an Asian supermarket or even your local place too. Like fried onions, right? Yeah, fried onions. Okay. It's going to be inside out row. And then uh, first I'm going to put the, the brie cheese in the, in the middle. And then nice. now, main ingredients. Uh, yeah, this one, the warm. I gotta put it all here. I'll put it all. Yeah, but oh, I wanna, you wanna say I some? keep some on the top too. Okay, so nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces. And then the rest of that I'm gonna put it here. Okay. Oh my goodness, I am touching the warm. It oh. <laughs> you used to go fishing a lot with your father, and you used yeah, to handle these I worms. I used to, I, I, I touch in a lot of worms for the, because of the fishing, you know? Right. Reason. But literally, not really. I don't know why. You gotta practice more. <laughs> yeah, practice more. So this is good. Yep, so for everything, right? Everything. Okay, good. Just set the pieces over here. And then roll it. <laughs> Coming out. Gotta keep it all inside. I wonder what the public opinion is about something like this. Do you think they would buy it? Well, if you uh, sell warm up to the public. Yeah. No, if you were to make this, would people come in? Oh, maybe not. Maybe not? Maybe not. Some people would be daring. I think there's a lot of people that would buy, you know, they'd probably buy anything that you'd make here. they pay for it. You yeah, think well, so? Yeah, for sure. Okay, let's come into the eight pieces. Listen to the crunch. Good. Okay. And look at something just sticking out there at the end. Yeah, one, one sticking out. It's a nice design. No? Yes. Let's see, I'm going to do a, like a face on, like this way. Oh, nice. Nice height. Nice, nice height. three dimensional look in this roll. Okay. And the, uh, I'm going to put a little bit of spice on my own on top of each glass of pizza. Great little kick on there. Yeah. And just in time for Halloween, right, Hero? Yeah, for oh, maybe Halloween roll. Halloween roll. Halloween roll. Okay, I okay. got a few more pieces left. More pieces on top. A little more. Just to make sure that we know yeah, this is what it's all about. Good. Maybe 
just for the Kara Scania a little bit. And our guests are hungry, right? <laughs> they just can't wait to dig in here. Oh. oh. Yeah, today's a. Uh, I'm, I'm not for. Oh, you have to, Hero. No. All of your no, fans want to see you taste one piece. I'm going to die. <laughs> you know. I'm telling you, what happens if there's no more bluefin tuna one day? Yeah. We're going to have to resort to eating things like this. And uh, what do you think about that? A little bit of masago? Yeah, masago yeah, for sure. Up to? Let's do it up. We have to treat our guest with the best that we have, right? Yeah, it's a little bit making it a little bit pretty, you know. Wow, I should just close my eyes and put one in my mouth. I think I'll have to do that. So here today, you test of this thing, I think cameraman do fast. <laughs> I'm the maybe, cameraman. Then everybody going to follow. That's cameraman, the cameraman's busy right now holding the camera. Really? Yes. All right, that's wow, it. Wow, oh that looks God. delicious, hero. Oh my gosh. Oh. You gonna try one? No. <laughs> <laughs> So for sure, the tasting part, we have Senor Jose, Senora Eliana, ¿Están listo? ¿Tiene hambre? No, pero es rico. You have a delicious meal right here. You excited, Jose? Yeah, it's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> My God, it's delicious. It's awesome. Hiro, you sure? <laughs> <laughs> okay, enjoy, en provecho. Thank you. You're welcome. Do you want one? No, no, no. <laughs> okay, let me show oh, one by one. Okay, let me show Lily. Oh my. Harico, no? Mm-hmm. That looks delicious for me. Harico. Mm. Harico. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was okay. You want some more wasabi? Quiero wasabi. <laughs> okay. Come, come. How's the taste? Try to describe the taste. You had the crunchiness of the the super worm. You have the smoothness of the brie cheese. Then you have this little wasabi mayo to give it a little kick. Masago at the very end. Maybe some texture from that. Yeah. I wish I could tell everybody what it tastes like. Okay. Jose, please. Enjoy. The one closest to you, it's got a nice one on top with them. Yes, that's a perfect one. You want some yeah, little wasabi? <laughs> Mm. Good. I like it. It's very really good. Oh, we dropped some. <laughs> 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 we dropped the super warm in the soy sauce. That's good, right? With mm. the soy sauce. That's like a great taste, I know. It's delicious. I like it. Very good. Good job. Very good. Thank you very much. You are the best. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll see you soon, Hero. Arigato. Yeah. You sure you don't want to taste no, it on the no, camera? Not today. Not today. <laughs> see you all soon. Thank you so see much. You soon.